Well, I'm a serial killer. I've killed eight women, six in this state, and two in New York. I'm not a big serial killer, by the way. Eight, eight people, that's nothing. I mean, there's, there's a lot of other guys you can go see. I saw this woman walking along the road with a uh, stroller. Uh, I pulled off the side of the road. Um, she came into the driveway, walked up the driveway. I was behind the house. Um, she saw me and I grabbed her. I told her that if she didn't do what I, I wanted, that I would smash the baby's head against the wall of the house. Um, where I think that's important is I've always said that uh, I never understood why the women never really resisted me. I never, I'm not a big, strong guy. Nobody ever seemed to fight. And I've always had attributed to it that I must say something like that, similar to uh, um, to the other victims. Uh, I raped her, strangled her. I left her for dead. The only reason she's not dead is uh, has nothing nothing to do with me. Right? So when I attacked her, I don't believe I was in control. I don't think I could have stopped. Um, reason I say that is because there's a very clear point to me after she was dead when I was feeling well, I didn't really feel anything I mean I knew what was going on and and I saw what was going on but it was more like watching an old film that we used to see as kids in the high school you know I mean in elementary school and they've been played so many times they're all spliced and, and they'd be going along and then jump you would think that if you killed somebody that you would have that face imprinted in your mind and that you wouldn't be able to get it out of your mind. I don't have that. I never had that. The only only face that I can see is what was in the newspapers a few days later when they were when they were missing. You know, like the high school picture. Anybody know where this girl is? Type thing. Um, that's when I think of them. That's the picture I see. I don't see them as they were when I killed them. I can't see them as I was killing them. When I say I don't have any remorse, that doesn't mean that I don't have any regrets, that I don't wish that didn't happen, that there was something I could do to bring them back or anything. It's just that I don't have any feelings towards them. I don't feel, I feel like I should be tormented by, by, by what they looked like when I was killing them or by tormented by what was happening immediately before I killed them and stuff. And none of that's there. None, none of that's there at all.